excuse me. Yeah, no, sorry, sorry. Thank you. <sighs> it's quite crowded in here. Your tea. No, it's all right. I got it. You can get the next one. So, I think it was a great idea to host this at the coffee shop. Mm-hmm. Yeah, lots of foot traffic. Well, thanks for inviting me. Mm-hmm. So, could you explain this pause for a good cause event? Great name, by the way. Um, what is the cause? And so people can adopt the puppies here today. Well, I hope every single one of them finds a home. It, it's awful to think that the, any of the shelters are at capacity. Hmm. Are you accepting donations too? Well, I'd like to. Oh. You picked the names in this litter? Okay. A surprise, sure. Mm hmm. That's great that they found homes. When uh, when did the last of them arrive? <laughs> They're late. I don't know, just the idea of puppies being late for something. Silly. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Puppies can do no wrong. I'm pretty sure we're all on their time. Mm-hmm. Okay, so you're off the clock until they get here. Okay. Are you sure that there isn't anything I can help with? Alright. All right. <clears throat> well. <sighs> have you been? Oh. I'm sorry. Yeah, I'm sorry to hear that. I didn't know. You didn't tell me. But you've been feeling sad, at least. And lonely. Yeah. I've been lonely, too. And you should have told me. I could have come over and... Oh. Um, no. I, uh, didn't know you two were dating. Hmm. No? Well, since when? Wait, no, no. If it's casual, then why do you feel this way? Okay, I'm sorry. If you told me, then I forgot. I... No, no, it's just... <sighs> Obviously, it's hard for me to keep up. I mean, it's difficult for me to keep up with the people that you spend time with and how you feel about them. <sighs> yeah, it's... It's just, you ask for my advice a lot. No, it's not a problem. I, I like that you do. I, what I mean is, no, 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 look, no, I don't mean that at, at all. I don't mean that at all. Hey, 
No, I would never say that. No, I, I'm not insinuating that you've dated so many people. I, hey, hey, please. I do want to help. I'm sorry, I'm just... I, I'm just tired, okay? It's been an overwhelming week. I'm, yeah, I'm okay. Yeah. No, please, go on. I, I want to listen. I hate to see you upset. Especially with those who don't deserve you. I'm sorry that happened. Breakups are hard. No matter how serious the relationship. Um, We've had this conversation before. Yeah. You're worth more than that. I wish you'd see it. No. I guess. I'm being standoffish. Look. No, I could say the same about you. At least, lately, you've been difficult to reach. I, look, I'm sorry. We, we shouldn't. We shouldn't be talking about this here. <laughs> no, it, no, it's me. It's me. I'm uh, in a mood today. I suppose. I might be minimizing my feelings. So... <laughs> no, this isn't the time nor the place for me to express how I actually feel. It's comments like that. Yeah. Y yeah, when you say things that make it seem like... I just... <sighs> what does that even mean? I mean... Why are you even asking if I'm minimizing my feelings when you don't seem to care? This it, Isn't this our friendship just as casual to you? I'm sorry. I... Right now? Are you sure you want to hear how I feel? Okay, well then. I feel like lately I've been some kind of um, teddy bear to you. Like, sometimes I'm just a shoulder for you to cry on. How could I not? feel that way. You've literally said to me that I'm your comfort person. Exactly. You reach for me when you need to cry or when you need to feel more secure. Yeah, 
today, for example, you invited me here to this coffee shop, you asked for my help with this event, and yet it seems that you don't need my help setting up for this at all. You just need my advice for your relationship. Did you even see the text that I sent you last weekend? Hmm? You never responded? Busy. Yeah. When you asked me to come today to support the cause, to support you, you even said that you missed me. And I can't say no to you. And to be honest, before you left me on red a few days ago, Stupidly, I thought that we had the same level of respect for one another. But it doesn't matter. <clears throat> I didn't say anything before because I, I just... I don't, I don't know. I, I don't know how to express this with you. I, I'm not as good with words. I'm just so used to being this for you, right? The emotional support, always here for you, especially when others aren't, right? Yeah, this. I feel that I meant to just Look confused and stay still, like the bear I gave to you. Yeah, you know. Rupert's expression, he's always uncertain, unmoving, like I am right now. Mm. <sighs> yeah, that's fair. I guess I am expressing other emotions right now. And I guess there is strength in that, too. In being there, unwavering, reliable. Yeah, whatever. Like, I don't know. I wouldn't have thought of that. Those words. I know, I know, I know there's nothing wrong with that. It's just difficult for me to be like that for you all of the time. No, it's my own doing. I'm not trying to blame you for that. I'm just... I feel like I'm a mess right now. And I'm sorry for acting so um, all over the place. I don't know. Yeah. No, look, look. It's not easy for me to say this, but... Um, Sometimes, I think I need a hug too. I need, I need to be reassured by you. <laughs> hey, <laughs> thanks. No, you... You didn't have... You know. 
I didn't mean that you needed to hug me right now. <laughs> no, you're right, you're right. <sighs> okay, I accept it. <laughs> Thank you. I know it's not your job to know that. It's my job to tell you my needs in this friendship. And I think it all just came to a boiling point this week. Well, I was upset when you didn't respond the other day. I was in a tough place and I reached out for your advice but that probably wasn't clear to you I, I, I didn't say that broke up with her. It was the right thing to do, given how I've, I feel. Um, well, I didn't tell you because you didn't respond to my text. No, no, I didn't, I didn't want to call and bother you. It, it was clear that you were busy. And I would never want to put that on you for you to handle. Thank you for your concern, but I'm fine. Or, or I will be. <laughs> In time. Yeah, I appreciate the apology. I just Today I feel like I'm getting upset for no reason. And I've just unloaded this on you here at the event. Oh, <clears throat> I'm sorry. No? You sure? Thank you for encouraging me. Um, but I, I still could have said something sooner. And today I could have been kinder. Again, I'm I'm sorry about this. I just. <laughs> Puppy dog guys, still. Even when I'm frustrated, I I guess I'm late then. Just like these puppies are. Yeah, in expressing this to you. Thank you for saying that you can handle it. And thank you for telling me it's okay. To uh, express my emotions, to, to share with you. To need your support too. I'm sorry for being so um, short with you today. <laughs> yeah, yeah.
Yeah. Okay. You're right. I'll stop apologizing, but um, just I just want you to know that it wasn't what I intended. I got um, upset thinking about you being hurt again by someone who blatantly doesn't see your value. And thinking about a world in which you don't value our friendship the same way I do. No, no, I... I know you do. But thank you for saying so. Thank you for bearing with me. <laughs> I've been a proper mess. Yeah. Yeah, I know. You see me as a comforting friend to be around, but that's that's not how I see it. I am? What do you mean by much more? I didn't... I, uh... I, I just, um... Sorry. Um... <clears throat> little uh, overwhelmed <laughs> well yeah I I didn't know that you felt that way so mm. you want to hear me say what out loud why practice communicating my thoughts really <sighs> okay um, this feels like you're being sneaky with me <laughs> okay fine 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 <clears throat> I didn't know that you value my empathy and how much you learn from me. And I didn't know that you love my sense of humor and how much fun you have with me. I... That I'm more than the only person you feel safe to be your true self around. I mean, it, it makes me feel better, but it's sad for you. Yeah, because anyone who knows the true you has been given a gift. And I wish that you were more comfortable showing who you are. More comfortable with expressing yourself around other people in your life, you know? Yeah, I do. I feel like I'm my true self around you, yeah. I mean... I, I wouldn't feel free to be me without you. Do you not feel like I am? Yeah. Hmm. No, you, you're right. You're right, you're right. I've, I've put myself in this position. <sighs> By being like Rupert. Dependable. Soft. 
but um, uncertain and still. Rupert's expression. I could have expressed myself, I could have shared my true feelings with you too, and I didn't realize I wasn't being my true self with you lately. I guess I've been shutting everyone out. Lonely for longer than I thought. It's it's because I yeah I know I know I'm gonna change that. Well, thanks for understanding and being willing to talk it through. I'm grateful for your reassurance that it's okay to talk about these things. Do you need to get that? It's okay. Everything all right? Okay. Did you just order a uh, caramel latte on the phone? <laughs> That's the name of one of the puppies. Okay. <laughs> That's really sweet. <laughs> hmm. Oh, they're here. Oh, I see. there they are. They're coming to the door. Oh. Wow. Macchiato and espresso. Have, did you name them all after coffee drinks? <sighs> I'm mad, but it's adorable. I... <laughs> oh, hello. Hello. Yeah, hey, cutie. Um, which one is this one? Caramel latte, your favorite, right? How how have you picked a favorite? <laughs> yes, I'm aware that it's your favorite coffee order. Hello, hello, hey you. Um, can I can I pick her up? Hey, puppy. <laughs> hello. Look at you. Mhm. Mm mm, yes, yes, you are sweet like a latte. Mm. Yes. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> mm, yeah, no, there is absolutely no way you are not finding a home today. Mm -mm -mm. Oh. <laughs> Look at this face. <laughs> Have you ever seen such a cute little face? <laughs> no, Rupert's, huh? Yeah. Yeah, Rupert's is pretty cute too. Oh, perfect. Yes, you are. What? You've never heard this voice before? <laughs> well, I can't help it. This brings the little baby voice out of me, and I can't change it. No, I won't. Mm. No, I cannot. I'm just expressing my emotions, aren't I? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, isn't that right, Caramel? Yeah. <laughs> Such an instant mood boost. Yeah, I, I feel so much better. Yeah, yeah, you were worth the wait, weren't you? Yes, you were. <laughs> uh, I think we need to go and help our friend over there, though. What do you think, little pup? 
Hmm? Yeah. You have an event to be part of. I have to show you off. I need to adopt a puppy. You think? <laughs> Who wouldn't want a caramel latte? Hmm? Really? Yeah. She would bring me a lot of comfort. As I would to you. Oh, yeah. Little head scratches. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Yeah, and treats too. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh, you like that, wouldn't you? Yeah, you would. <laughs> She's so soft. Yeah. You want to come along on walks with us? I'd love that. And I think she would love that too. Spending more time with you. <laughs> Not very casual though. Bit of a commitment. Bit of a commitment. <laughs> hey, oi. Kisses being sneaky with me, eh? <laughs> Who could resist? <laughs> I, I've, I've never thought about a pet. I guess I've never had the space until now. Nor the time. I don't even want to place you down on the floor. Oh, let alone show you off to everyone here at the shop. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> Probably because you keep giving me little puppy kisses. <laughs> I guess we are destined to be friends too. Hmm? What do you say? Caramel latte? Hmm? Oh, what a big voice for such a little pup. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I w yeah, I will. If you'll adopt me too, hmm? It's decided. She's spoken for. <laughs> uh, where do I sign? I, yeah, I guess I did do my part in helping with this event. <laughs> yeah. Yes. Were you my little caramel latte? Yes, you are. Yes, you are. Oh, oh, thank you. Yeah, I'm honored. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I, I do need your help, though. I have no idea what a puppy needs. Um, would you be willing to walk me through it? Please? <laughs> what? What's the look for? Oh, oh, both of us and our puppy dog eyes. Uh, too much? Oh, I guess it is too much. She can't resist us, can she? No. No, who could say no to us? <laughs> Can you handle it? Hmm? <laughs> Thank you. <sighs> okay, Caramel. Let's go over to the playpen over here and help you and help find your brother and sister at home. Mm hmm. Yeah, I think you have something special with our puppy dog eyes. All right, um, you need me to uh, gather these clipboards over here? Yeah, I can set up the uh, 
flyers on the table too. Yeah. Ne? Yeah. I think I am ready for a pub. I feel it in my gut. Yeah. Look at her. She's perfect. Should make a fantastic friend. She reminds me of you a little bit. Of course I'm smiling. <laughs> yeah, how could I not? See, she'll teach me how to express my emotions too. Yeah, pause for a good cause, huh? Yeah, well, you didn't tell me I'd be the cause. <laughs> I am. <laughs> am I your charity now? Well. I guess so. Um, oh, yeah, no. I'm a lonely orphan in need of love and support whose friends are at absolute capacity. <laughs> hey, no, I'm kidding. Hey. I know. Please. You can't keep apologizing, and neither can I. No? Yeah, I understand. Well... You know, you're the cause too. Because <laughs> you're my best friend and the one I reach for. Yep. I'm going to reach for you to help me set up my place for caramel. And a whole bunch of other stuff. Yeah. Yeah. But really, um, you're my teddy bear, too. Yeah, and when I'm not good with words, you always come through. Yeah? Well, I... Learn the words from you. Mm -hmm. You're the cause, the support, um, the person I come to, and I wouldn't feel free to be me without you.